I just went back and looked at the video that I made the day that I got scammed for those pictures, and I was still homeless when that happened. <laughs> I was staying in a hotel, but I was still technically homeless when this child scammed me for these pictures that they are now going to put me in prison for. A child asked a homeless woman for naked photographs and offered her money. A child offered a homeless woman money and the homeless woman accepted not knowing that it was a child offering it. I was homeless and desperate. And now I'm gonna die in prison because I was homeless and desperate and a child took advantage of that situation. You never expect a child to do things like that. You never expect a child to manipulate and take advantage of grown people and then it's the grown person that is responsible because the, the other is just a child. And there's nothing I can do about it except fight it when it goes to court and have the chance to ask this 14-year-old child why they spent a year messaging a homeless woman, offering a homeless woman money for a naked photograph. Why would you do that? Why would you go out of your way like that to ruin somebody's life who has nothing? I was literally homeless at the time. I could not have gotten any lower in life and now they're, they were setting me up to ruin my life. <laughs> They were setting me up to destroy my life while I was already homeless. They planned this. They set this up and planned it. That person messaged me for over a year. Over and over and over again they messaged me asking me if I needed money. They followed my post. They knew that I was an adult. They knew that I was homeless. They knew that I was desperate. They knew about me and I didn't know anything about them except that they had money. Supposedly because they told me they had money. I never expected a child to do this. You expect adults to do this to children. To follow a child and take pictures of them. But you never expect a child to stalk an adult for the purposes of putting them in prison. <laughs> I was literally stalked by a child for the sole purpose of putting me in prison. That was the only reason they did it. They couldn't have had any other reason. They never sent me the money. So what other reason could they have had for wanting these photographs? They sold them out so quickly to send to the police to put me in prison, knowing that I didn't do anything to them. I didn't even get the money for them. And now I'm going to go to prison and I'm going to be killed in prison because I showed a picture of my breasts. And I didn't know who saw it. I just knew that I was desperate and needing money. I was literally homeless. <laughs> we all literally found a homeless person and then convinced them to give you something for money just so you could put them in jail for it. 